the Google Scholar Citation Visualization Tool by CalciRose. To get out, we're going to show you how to quickly install and then run the application. For starters, navigate your window to www.mitoverj.com slash calci. From here, you can click and drag the link up into your bookmarks tab, like so. Once that's done, navigate to any Google Scholar page and type in any search term. Now, once we're here, we'll simply click on the link up in your bookmarks tab and you'll see a menu generated on the right hand side of your screen, like so. Also added is a dynamic link next to each search term. If you mouse over that search term, it'll show you the publication date for the first hundred documents that cite this document. On the right hand side, you'll see a menu that shows the option for two trees, with it creating the dynamic space tree. This is your original search term, and each of these is the first ten documents that cite this term. Clicking on a node will show you the first ten documents that cite that term. Like so. You can follow this chain all the way down. By single clicking on a node, you can see the node's information on the right hand side as, long as well as a link to that document. Closing that down, we also have a three level deep R graph. This generates a static graph that shows the first ten documents that cite your term as well as the first ten documents that cite each of those. As you can see, like so. Clicking on any single node will show that, that node's information. You can see from this, the red nodes are the nodes with the least citations in the graph, and the green nodes are the nodes with the most citations in the graph. For each of these graphs, you can also export to TSV. Thanks for listening.